Hey guys, and welcome back to another video on my channel. And today I just wanted to do a review, kind of like just a review on this art set that I got at a toy store a few, like maybe two weeks ago. Um, we went to a mall, the mall, and had some. Well, we, I don't know if we had some fun, but we were busy shopping, so. Um, yeah, so this is it. It's the Art 101 Drawing and Sketch Set. So we're going to open this up. I think it comes with a sketch pad. So, yeah. Oh, yeah, it does. So I thought I needed paper, but I've been waiting a few weeks to do, do this. So, um, and I figured since we were going to the art store, my tomorrow to get the supplies for my art project for school um i might have something to bring back to show you as like a haul video um or some coins but okay so um yeah there's a sketch pad that i hope is included in here oh God. okay so there, a pencil fell out, so I'll just put this here. Yeah, there's there's some some good things in here. I'm just trying to get all of it out so I can. And I was doing these today's Monday, um, since it's Martin Luther King Jr. Day, um, and. We had day days off from school, so I figured I'd do this in advance um, before I had school. And I don't have that much school. I only have, like, tomorrow's, probably tomorrow's worth of school work for this week. So I'm probably going to either be filming some more videos, maybe, like, a whole video for, like, Michaels or something. But I don't know. So um, there's these. There's one. This one's a charcoal pencil. It has no, like, cap. So there's four graphite ones, a charcoal one. I thought it kind of thought it would be woodless. And then two blending tools. These are more fancy than the ones that I usually use. Um, then a pencil sharpener, which I'm probably going to be need for doing this. Um, I have my wood panel here, which I'm actually using for one of my art projects, but I'm using it as a backdrop for now. Um, so here's that sketch pad. Um, and then I think this is like a postcard. I'm not sure what that is. And then here's like the, uh, instruction manual, which I don't need because I know how to use these. Um, but yeah, so there's a pretty, it's pretty much like an art, art pad, <laughs> That you would use in art class. Um, so I'm just gonna open this up. I'm gonna open it up to the second page. The pages are actually not too bad. I think that's the first page. Okay, I'm gonna fold this down so that way I can... Okay, so I'm gonna start by sharpening each pencil. I'm not gonna, I don't think I'm gonna do these in order, but... I like sharpening pencils, especially round ones, because they uh, sharpen the easiest. And I just like, think it's satisfying to do it. Yeah, so that's the basics of it. You just put the pencil in and there you go. There's a fairly uniform point on there. But.
Oh, that one's a good point right there. That one I did way better of a point than... I'm gonna get my hands all graphite-y after I just took a shower, so... This one's 4B. The sharpener down instead of up, so that way I can... Okay, I'm gonna pause it and when I have everything ready, I'll be back. I thought it came with this little pan, so that way I can dump the graphite chunks in there. Alright, we have everything set up, and I'm going to start with the pencils, the graphite pencils. And then I'm going to do the charcoal pencil last. I'm going to try to do this in order, from HB to 6B. But... There's ones that are missing in between, but we'll test that. Um, I'll show you when I'm done with each pencil and each um, piece of equipment. I will um, show you what it, how it is. Okay, so here, here's the HB. The HB. Right there. It's pretty dark. It's actually darker than I would have expected. Um, now, I guess this one. Oh, that's 4B. Okay. The 6B sharpened the best, which is odd, but here's 2B. Oh, I can tell it's already getting darker. Um, and then here's the uh, 2B, this one. Is darker if you can tell the difference. Then 4B. Sorry, I'm left handed so that graphite gets up everywhere. 4B. And last but not least, this one sharpened the best out of the points. Um, but compared to the charcoal one, I think not. <laughs> but this one, this one like has a bigger point because it's charcoal, so. Six. Oh no, I'm not using the right one. Wow. Okay. Six. Yeah, these are nice. Wow. So. Okay. And now for the charcoal. So I would say this would be like an 8B or a 9B. Probably one of those, not 8, 9, or 10B maybe. Okay, so I wrote, I don't know if I spelled charcoal right, but here it is. It's the darkest out of all of them, and it's 8 to 12B, so, yeah. Um, and then the blending stump. So, I'm going to test it with the um, darkest graphite pencil, not the charcoal, because it definitely wouldn't smudge that well, because it's really dark and dense. So I'm going to try it with the 6B, which is the darkest graphite pencil, although charcoal has graphite in it. So we're going to... People, if you are going to be in the comments and being like, oh, that's lead, I'm going to be like, nope, it's graphite, because it is, it is graphite. Pencils were never made out of lead, as I learned from my, my felt... Well, I'm subscribed to him. His name is Super V Power. His real name is Vikram Shah, and I, I watched him, and he it did a whole 
30 minute video explaining pencils and that's where I got a lot of my information. But yeah, that does do a good job. That down there, that's how it's smudged. So, there you go. Oh, I just turned the light on, so. Um, and now, I think the last thing, we already test out the sharpener. And the sharpener is pretty good. Um, so this set was actually surprisingly good. Um, I, I, I liked it. Um, so. Now let's do the eraser. And just for good measures, I'll do the 2B. I was going to do the HB, but I feel like the 2B is a little bit more challenging for the eraser. So, yeah. I'm just going to erase a section here. And it did it okay. The eraser is probably not the worst thing out of here. I'm not I'm not saying the set's bad, it's just this is not the best eraser. And it's definitely not as good compared to the pencils, the sharpeners, and the smudge tool. But you know, it's still good. Um, so yeah, that's it's not much it's pretty a pretty good art set and it is I would say it's pretty high quality, so uh, although the peeling on the eraser came off, so, but, you know, it's not bad, it's, I'm gonna have to tape that, but, I'll just leave it for now. Anyway, um, I guess that's it, um, I'll probably be using this drawing pad when I'm out on the go, um, cause I, whenever I get art sets like this, I always use the drawing pad, because it, it's great for doing art on the go. And these supplies I might even take on the go, too. I'm, you never know. So, but yeah. These were pretty good supplies. Um, I liked the art set. Um, and I'll be filming another video on some coins that I searched again. Um, that video is after this one, so this one will probably be uploaded first. But I'm just going to do a quick, maybe like five minute video on that. So... Stay tuned for that. Um, I'll be doing it right after this one. So, anyway, um, I'm just using this wood backdrop. You can't really see it that well, but until I actually do that art project, it will just use it for that. Um, but yeah, anyway, um, subscribe, like, comment. I always like people who comment. Anything, really. Um, just, yeah, just support the channel and... I recently just hit 100 followers on my Instagram, so um, if you want to go check out my Instagram, that will be in the description, um, what my, the name is of my Instagram. So, anyway, um, I'll see you guys next time, and see ya.